Okay everyone, I'm getting ready to do a load of laundry and I do get asked what I do and so those of you that are new or those of you that just want some education on what can be used, I just wanted to show you. Um, the first thing that I use is the Thieves Laundry Soap. It's all natural plant-based. It's a wonderful product and the bottle that I order I lasts me close to six months, a little more, a little less depending upon how much laundry I do. I do loads of laundry a lot. <laughs> so I can say I probably do a load a day or every other day two loads. And we have three in our family, but I still do a lot of laundry. I wash my rugs every week in the whole house as well. So that's another load that I'm not even including. So the first thing I do when I'm doing wash is I've taken it out of what it came in and I've put it in this little mason jar dispenser thing. And I did that because I don't want to dilute it because you don't really have to because once the water inside your washing machine is going, you don't need to put it in bottles and add water. It's kind of self-defeating and I'm more practical and don't have time for that. So I just use less pumps because it's going to work the same way when it mixes with the water. Why stick it in three bottles and make it go further? Just to me that didn't make sense. So at any rate, what I do is I simply take this and I give it one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to do six pumps. Of course, sometimes, you know, if I have a really big load, like it's really heavy, I do kind of have a big load here. This is what I'm getting ready to put in and it's full. Um, but if it's like massive, then, you know, I'll add a little more. So then after that, and I'm just going to start it and hopefully you'll still be able to hear me. So I get it going and sometimes people are like, well, does it bubble up? Bubbling up does not mean that it's clean. So I'm just going to go ahead. If you do stick it in here and you add some pumps in there, it will give you some bubbles. So I just want to keep the bubbles. Okay. I'm going to stop that because it's hard to hear. You can see it. Okay. Sorry guys. I want to stop it because it's hard to hear. But the other thing I do is it's kind of a laundry boost and I don't mean that I really need any boost because this cleans, but instead of using a liquid fabric softener in the center, this is what I use right here. So I make this and I'll tell you what this is. This is simply baking soda, Epsom salts, and then whatever oil that you want to add that you like. Some people like to add thieves. I love to add gentle baby. And so I usually take a jar or a big box of the baking soda, add that in there, usually like one cup of um, Epsom salt, and then as many drops as you want. Um, you know, I might do 10, 15, 20, however, you know, strong I like the smell. And I put it in here and I simply mix it all up. And then what I do, and this stuff lasts a good long time. This is a fourth a cup. And so what I do is just kind of sprinkle it around inside there in the wash. Um, because baking soda is also known to help clean and stuff like that. And it does. It just makes it soft. I like it. And so that's all I do. And then I add my clothes and shut the lid. Very, very simple. When it comes to drying, um, oh, one more thing. I do have this bottle here because if I have a stain, the Thieves Household Cleaner is very great at treating stains. You can mix a little bit of the Thieves um, laundry soap with it in a concentrated smaller bottle along with this or you can just make your household cleaner if it's a light stain. And so I'll use this or I'll make it a little stronger, you know, if I have a heavier stain. But typically this works for light stains. All right, and so then for the dryer, which is pretty simple, uh, excuse my dryer ball, it's well loved. Um, this is a wool dryer ball, dryer ball. I have about four in my dryer. And what I simply do instead of dryer sheets, which are toxic, is I take my wool dryer ball and then I add some of my oils on there. Let me see if I can do that while you are watching. So you just simply turn it and add your drops. And I'll put three or four drops on, sometimes two, it just depends on what, what I want. And then I discovered Seedlings Baby Wipes, which are absolutely amazing. This is such a great product. It's great for your baby, but it's also great as a dryer sheet. So I add this and this, just one in my dryer. It's There's 72 in here, so you get a lot. I get 72 loads with that. So that's what I do for my wash and what I do for whenever I am drying. So hope that's helpful. If you have any questions, let me know. Bye, guys.